Like many airports, Orlando International Airport kept building through the pandemic. Not only did altered travel patterns make MCO the world's seventh busiest airport in 2021, but can also work continued on a new $2.8 billion terminal that will open next month. The new terminal encompasses 300 acres and adds 15 gates, increasing airport capacity by an estimated 10 million to 12 million passengers. In 2021, the airport ranked 7th in the world with 43 million passengers. In 2019, it ranked 31st in the world with 56 million passengers. Pandemic travel pattern restrictions sharply reduced international travel, while you as domestic leisure travel recovered quickly, particularly in Florida and other parts of the South. What distinguishes Terminal C, besides modernity, sweeping views in one 8 million square feet of space, is technology improvements, particularly in security and baggage handling. We are excited rolling out a terminal that is at the cutting edge of passenger convenience and leveraging technology, said CEO Kevin Thibault. The technology is so splashy, Thibo said, that it could boost airport traffic, especially once it is linked to a rail line that will offer 18 daily trips between the airport and heavily populated South Florida. Orlando passed Miami International as Florida's busiest airport in 2017. Meanwhile, the counties surrounding Orlando have grown rapidly, both before and during the pandemic. Some of the technology improvement is in security, at the gates as well as at the Transportation Security Administration security stations. At the gates, passengers will be cleared to board using facial recognition. We will have this technology at each and every gate, in place of a boarding pass and scanning, we both said. Meanwhile, TSA security has been upgraded. Terminal C will have 8 lanes for TSA clearance, with the capacity to add 4 more. A new feature is that if a bag screening conveyor slows, agents at a different station, using a different scanner, can take over and scan bags. If lane 4 has a backup, or an agent gets distracted, agents at a remote station can look at the baggage from somewhere else, Thibo said. It won't be as visible but the airport will also have state of the baggage handling, one that uses radio frequency identification, RFID, as bags are transported from the aircraft to baggage claim. 